thank you, students, who I know how pressed you are because this is exams time. So the fact that you've taken time here to be is really, really something I'm very thankful. I think it's really important for us, for me especially, and for my colleagues, as students of economics, to have an opportunity to talk with President Draghi. I think it's, it's amazing because we just read about uh, ECB policies and now we have this, uh, uh, we, we can ask uh, directly to Mario Draghi. Usually we go around and we talk. It's us who talk. Now this time it's us who want to listen. We, how do we as young economists, managers, bankers, how can we create these dialogue platforms like this one to become more active, more informed citizens? And how can we help other citizens also understand the policy stance? Thank you. You have boundless technology possibilities for uh, strengthening, for enhancing your social capacity. Uh, it's quite clear that all this is going to be an energy for good if it produces reliable and transparent information. That's the pillar of trust. So we've now got a question coming from quite far away via LinkedIn from China. I think it was good because the ECB is such a distant institution and today we felt that it was close to us, to the students and to society.